guys, so today I'm going to show you how I put a harness on my bird. Come on, come on. Good boy. Okay, so first thing, this is the long part and there's a short part. You put the long part on the back, put this loop over his head, just like that. And then long wings, right here. And then you take it over. Put here a second wing, ah. right? And then you have all these stuff in front. And then you just close it up like this. Ah. Right. Good. Make sure nothing is twisted. Everything is comfortable here. Something is twisted here. Ah. Fix it. Good. Step up. Step up. And just like that, you have the inventory harness on him. And then here's a little loop. See that? And you can put it on your wrist. Now, we have a second bird. Let's go get him. So this is my second bird. His name is Love. He's the highest of my heart. And we do the same thing like with him. So, this is his blue harness. Again, this is the long part. And here's a short part. The long part comes over his head like this. Right here, like this. There we go. Then wings. Good. One wing. Good. You can put it down. And then two. Oh! It's right here. It's very sensitive. And then here, see this? This, you shorten it up. And tighten it up. Make sure nothing is twisted, that he's comfortable. Oh yeah, it's all right. It's all right. And then you pull this. You see here some slack? Make sure the slack is gone. We can kind of pull this over like that. Adjust it here. And then we can shorten the slack right here. Right there, right there, see? And now he's tight over his belly. You see, I can put two fingers in. It doesn't hurt him. But you see, he's now in his harness. Then I have here, this part, and this part comes over my hand, just like hope. And he, step up, is in his harness as well. That's how I do harness training. And you have to teach your bird while they're young and get to used to the harness. This is the new farm freedom. Right. All right, now I can go out. And both of them are secure right here. You can also, you see this is a nice rubber, not rubber, like elastic. You can also extend it, but this is more than enough for me. I also customize it and put this metal piece in between it because if it's not, you see I put a small metal in here, kind of two on it, because I'm always afraid if this breaks, they can get loose. But see for the highest set, for love, I pick, put a big metal. And for Hopi, I put a small metal <laughs> where the leash are ended. And that's it. That's how you harness train your bird and put your the Avery harness into your bird. Now I can show you, you see this is an old harness. Those harness gets chewed on a lot. You see this? It's broken. Got two on. You see this? Broken. Got two on. So I always have to fix it up like this and make it really, really strong. Or you have to buy new harnesses. You see that? Every year because these are there are some points where they chew on and then they break. That's it. Thanks for watching. If this was helpful and you like this video, give us a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe to Caroline von Petzold, Born to Free Fly. It's a beautiful day to be alive. Get my book, How to Train Your Parrot and More, on my website, angelicparrots.com. I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.